Hey, this is Chris Merritt, the State Historic Preservation Officer in Utah. I'm coming to you today from Fort Douglas. Most people don't know that Fort Douglas is actually one of Utah's 14 National Historic Landmarks. It was transferred to the University of Utah in the early 1990s by the Department of Defense. And now the University of Utah is the steward of this property and includes the Fort Douglas Military Museum, which is a partnership with the Utah National Guard and the University of Utah. So now we're on Stillwell Field, which has been the fort's military parade ground since 1862. But if you look around, many people don't realize that state land like this, because it's managed by the University of Utah, is actually protected by cultural resource law. Now it is against the law to unlawfully remove archeological objects from state lands. If you get caught the first time, it's a class B misdemeanor. If you get caught a second time, or you've done over $500 worth of damage to the archeological site, it's a class three felony. All right, so this is why I'm coming to you today from Stillwell Field, is that recently the University of Utah caught a metal detectorist digging here on the parade ground and actually caused a significant amount of damage. This is only one of over a dozen holes that removed 19th century period artifacts from this landscape. And every time someone removes those artifacts, we've lost an ability to tell Utah's history just a little bit more. 